if we were to take a step back and say, what is it that you would like to tell your son or daughter that you're proud of in them? That you see that Allah has given them a gift, something that validates them. There are people that die for this and they don't get it from their parents. And even if they get it, like if for example, one time the child, the daughter decides that she's going to cook something for the first time. She's going to learn to cook to make her mom proud. And she finally learns to cook and make something good and everybody likes it. The mom says, it's good. Finally, huh? <laughs> Had to throw something in. You have to throw something because it took you long enough. You couldn't make anything else, right? You have to throw something negative in, not just the positive. Those few positive words you say to your children and you say to your family, you don't know what dark environment they find themselves in. And those words are the only reason they don't fall into darkness. You see? That's a pretty critical thing. It's a really serious thing. And human beings are capable of tolerating a lot of difficulty from the outside. But the difficulty that family brings to family is much more difficult to swallow. Be careful of these words there in a hamana. These children that we have, this family that we have, the way we speak to them, we have to be very careful. If you have nothing good to say, stay silent. Just don't say anything.